Hello everybody, uh, I know this isn't, I know in my last video rather, that there was going to be an unboxing, but really it's not an unboxing, um, I did want to let you guys know that the unboxing, what I originally did was I ordered two 8 gigabyte flash drives from Staples, and they were like 30 something dollars for both of them, put together instead of spending like 50 or 60 dollars on one just regular 16 gigabyte so it was really a great deal and they were on clearance too here's what the box looks like you can see how I tore it open and everything but basically that's what the box looks like and the top just looks like this nothing special see 8 gigabyte and here's exactly what they look like they have um they are translucent okay and uh, this thing here is an orange light and they are very soft and squishy I like playing around with them sometimes uh, but yeah they're very they are very very easy to handle super easy to actually take off the top if I had my two hands I'd be able to but well I would I would be able to do it easily uh, with my two hands, but, yeah, just take my word for it, they're not too hard to get off. It's only because I'm holding the camera with one hand, and the flash with the other. I also found, the other day, a hub, that I guess my parents got a long time ago. Now, I asked my mom what this was. She said it's to connect multi-computers together into one, I was like, well, can I kind of, you know, use it for my flash drives? Because I was talking to... Okay, sorry. Okay, sorry about that. Uh, it cut out on me. The batteries died, and I just changed them. As you can see. See? Changed them. I'm using... By the way, don't know if I ever showed anybody. I bought a 30-pack of, uh, Rayovac batteries. You know, cheap. Ten bucks. Walmart. Got it. Probably two months ago. Anyways, and these batteries in the camera have lasted about a month. Anyways, so, yeah. I was talking to a friend online. Actually, Jeff from the radio, DJ Canadian Jeff. I don't know if you guys have ever even heard him online yet. Uh, my radio is opening up soon. So go ahead and go to the site, www.utterlycrazyradio.com. Link will be in the description. But so, yeah, I was talking to him the other day about it. Whoops. I knocked out the drive. Anyways, I was talking to him the other day, and um, he said that he had one that could connect six USBs together. I was like, yeah, sure, I have one that connects, like, four USBs. And his actually is white. It's like a white stick. It has one, two, three, four, five, and then, like, six, seven. And I asked him, because I have one, and I asked him, can I use mine to connect all my flash drives together? And he's like, I don't know. So, I tried it, and it works fine. I mean, you know, I've got, I actually had to rename all my flash drives because I had like 50 million plugged in. And, uh, can't really see them. But one, my L is 8 gigabyte computer. Uh, I is 4 gigabyte flash, which is the one right here where I hold everything for Yahoo, all the programs that I have coded in uh, Visual Basics, or have gotten to just mess around with on Yahoo, and now the flash drives are getting all knocked out. Um, 2 gigabyte that I'm still transferring off of, here is the second 8 gigabyte, and still the first right here see it wasn't that hard to actually hook up this hub it's called a hub USB hub it was very easy I didn't have to install anything just pop this pops up every now and then if you uh, just telling you that the USB device can perform faster if you connect to a high-speed USB 2.0 port for a list of available ports click here I click there you know and it comes up with unused port, unused port, all these different ports that I could connect to, and I don't know which is which on the uh, hub. I got a new background, as you guys may have seen in my video. 
uh, my last video, which was the one about renaming the recycle bin. Can't see that, but it's a trash can. I actually cleaned up my desktop. The first uh, flash drive that I was getting was for my music. I just cleaned out all my music, you know, so I don't have to keep going into here. And every time I reformat, I lose all my almost. Well, I use some of the song, lose some of the songs on my uh, music, and I don't know why it just it happens. But so you know, I just re-download them if I don't have them. They're on my iPod, so it doesn't matter. Um, I don't even know if I ever told anybody about this. And yeah, my desk is a mess, but I've been trying to clean it up. Uh, I'm cleaning up every other day now because it just gets messy with all the stuff that I burned in the disc. I've got about, let's see here, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14 operating systems including Windows 7 and Windows Vista Ultimate, Windows Vista Premium Lite. These three here are my um, drivers for XP. Uh, I've also got Ubuntu that I ordered like three months ago I think. Yeah, around three months ago. I did a video on it. Ubuntu 8.10 desktop edition. It was free. Open source. Very, very cool. Um, but I do I do have a printer, like eighty dollar printer, not that expensive. Um but you guys need to check out definitely check out the radio site. I have some money saving offers there. But anyways, yeah, so check it out, I have some money saving offers and uh basically that's all I wanted to say for now. Sorry, it wasn't really an unboxing. But uh I printed off about hundred dollars worth of savings of coupons so yeah anyways thank you very much for watching this video and uh, I will see you next time